Sadistic Personality Disorder. Sadistic Personality Disorder is a personality disorder diagnosis involving sadism which appeared in appendix of the revised third edition of the APA's Diagnostic and Statistical Manual of Mental Disorders. The later versions of the DSM do not include it. Definition, comorbidity with other personality disorders. Removal from the Diagnostic Statistic Manual. Subclinical sadism in personality psychology. The definition. Sadism involves gaining pleasure from seeking, excuse me, sadism involves gaining pleasure from seeing others undergo discomfort or pain. The opponent process theory explains the way in which individuals not only display but also take enjoyment in committing sadistic acts. Individuals possessing sadistic personalities tend to display recurrent aggression and cruel behavior. Sadism can also include the use of emotional cruelty, purposely manipulating others through the use of fear and preoccupation with violence. Theodore claimed there were four subtypes of sadists, which he termed explosive sadism, tyrannical sadism, enforcing sadism, and spineless sadism. The explosive sadistic personality is categorized by unpredictability, precipitous outbursts in fury, uncontrollable rage, and fearsome attacks. Feelings of humiliation are pent up and discharged and is subsequently contrite. The tyrannical sadistic personality relishes brutalizing and menacing others, forcing them to cower and submit. It is verbally cutting and scathing, accusatory, destructive, intentionally surly, abusive, inhumane, inhumane, unmerciful. Comorbidity with other personality disorders. Sadistic personality disorder is often found to occur in unison with other personality disorders. Studies have also found that sadistic personality disorder is the personality disorder with the highest level of comor excuse me, comorbidity to other types of psychopathological disorders. In contrast, sadism has also been found in patients who do not display other forms of psychopathic disorders. One personality disorder that is often found to occur alongside sadistic, excuse me, alongside sadistic personality disorder is conduct disorder, not an adult disorder, but one of childhood and adolescence. Studies have found other types of illnesses such as alcoholism to have a higher rate of comorbidity with sadistic personality disorder. Researchers have had some level of difficulty distinguishing sadistic personality disorder from other forms of personality disorders due to its high level of comorbidity with other disorders. Numerous theorists and clinicians introduced sadistic personality disorder to the Diagnostic Statistical Manual in 1987 and was placed in the DSM-3R as a way to facilitate further systematic clinical study and research. It was proposed to be included because of adults who possessed sadistic personality traits but were not being labeled even though their victims were being labeled with a self-defeating personality disorder. Theorists like Millen want to generate further study on sadistic personality disorder and so proposed it to the Diagnostic Statistical Manual for Personality Disorder Workgroup who rejected it, according to this encyclopedia. Subclinical sadism in personality psychology. This is a renewed interest in studying sadism as a non-disordered personality trait Everyday sadism joins with subclinical psychopathy, narcissism, and Machiavellianism to form the so-called dark tetrad of personality. 
and also about antisocial personality disorder, malignant narcissism, psychopathy, sadism and masochism, self-defeating personality disorder, masochistic personality disorder, sexual sadism disorder. Read all about sadistic personality disorder. Sadistic personality disorder. Sadistic personality disorder.